BCS is phasing out the HEQ. If you've not heard about the HEQ, they refer to the higher education qualifications and they are one of the best known suite of qualifications from the British Computer Society. But then, BCS is phasing out the HEQ. So what does that mean for you if you are already an HEQ student or if you're planning to begin on the HEQ program? I'm going to break that down in this very short video. Please stay with me. So if you've been following my channel, you would know about the HEQ program. The HEQ refers to the higher education qualifications, they are undergraduate level qualifications from BCS, the Chartered Institute for IT, also known as the British Computer Society. And I run TWIM Institute, which is a center in Nigeria for the British Computer Society. So if you check on my channel, you would see that I've put out a lot of videos about BCS activities and the BCS HEQ. So um, it's a little saddening to have to break this news to you, but BCS is phasing out the HEQ program. So first of all, are they phasing out their certifications like their business analysis certifications and the other ones? No, those are not the HEQ, those are their certifications. So um, the foundation certificate in business analysis, the international diploma in business analysis and all those other certifications will continue to exist. Those are not the HEQ. Um, but the HEQ program is what is being phased out. And considering that BCS has students from all over the world, with the biggest markets being in places like Sri Lanka, um, and I know they have a, a, a pretty decent market in Nigeria as well, I know that many students are disappointed and they are wondering, what next? What do you do now if you already have... Um, if, if you're already studying as a BCS student, what do you need to do next? Well, the answer to that is simple. Keep studying. Keep studying. The only thing is you need to finish it as quickly as possible because you have a three-year um, timeline. They're going to phase out the program by um, 2026. And so that implies that from now, this is 2023, so there's a three-year timeline. Um, you need to wrap it up in three years. And that implies that if you're just planning to start, you still have enough time. You, you can do your level four and then go on to level five and um, level six if you want to, or you can top up. You can do all of that within three years. So you're covered. Secondly, if you are... Um, a past BCS student, maybe you've completed um, any of their levels or maybe you've even gone through the entire program and you're wondering what will happen to the validity of your certificates. Well, I've got good news for you. Your certificates are off call accredited certificates. Nothing is going to happen. So even though the program is being phased out, it does not in any way affect the validity of your certificates. You have them and they are valid for life. They are government backed. They remain government backed. They remain valid. So in, in that sense, you, you don't need to have any worries. I know that the other question you might have is, what next? What next after the HEQ? What, what is BCS bringing out next? Unfortunately, I don't have the answer to that question at this time. Uh, nobody knows for sure right now. And we're waiting to see what BCS is going to release next. I am hoping that it's going to be a replacement for the HEQ that would also be off-call accredited and be able to serve all those wonderful purposes that the HEQ could serve. So it should be something that is usable as um, a university-level diploma, usable for things like um, the Canada Express entry and stuff like that. And I'm hoping that it would be something that people would be able to do from all over the world. Um, so I'm optimistic, I'm hopeful that they will bring out a replacement that will maybe even solve some of the challenges 
with the HEQ. But sadly, at this time, we don't have information about it. Nobody knows for sure. In any case, for updates about the BCS program, you can be sure that I will bring them to you. Just make sure you click on the subscribe button so that you can have access to more and more of my content and turn on notifications so that you get to know when I post a new video. Um, and also, there are many other programs that we offer at Swim Institute. Please make sure you follow me so that you can find out some more about them. If you're looking to maybe boost your points for express entry, we have different programs that can be helpful to you. More importantly, if you're looking to maybe get into a career in tech or get into a career in business and prepare yourself in a way that will make you globally relevant, we have options for you at TWIM Institute. So make sure you follow me, make sure you check out our link which is in the description. Go to twiminstitute.com forward slash tech school and make sure you just find out about what we're doing at the Institute. I look forward to seeing you in my next video. Until then, my name is Olumide Adeleye. Do have a lovely day.